morning everybody happy wednesday i wasn't really planning on vlogging today and i actually never vlog on wednesdays because my prep is like in my classroom so i um have to leave and i'm not gonna like start recording myself but my sunburn is a little bit better it's a little bit blotchy like where i put my makeup but listen it's better than what it was <laughs> um so yeah today is wednesday i was off yesterday i had a like the worst day <laughs> i actually took off for orientation in south carolina and i started to vlog this but i deleted the footage because i just had like the worst day i never got sent the actual link for the orientation it was like on zoom and so i was emailing everybody for like a while and nobody was answering me i emailed like hours before the thing um i emailed the day before i'm like hello is anyone gonna send me this link I'm calling people, nobody's answering. And then after the orientation was over, of course they answer and they're like, oh my gosh, I'm so sorry, reschedule it. And I'm like, guys, I literally took off of work for that. So that was a waste of time. So that's how my day started. And then, and like me and Billy were like trying to figure everything out. Like, what are we doing wrong? Something has to be wrong. Cause I had a link, but it was not the correct, doesn't matter. So that's how the day started. And then Billy and I had to go all the way like out, we call it out east um like 50 minutes away to get th something for our marriage license signed and so we drive all the way out there we pull up to the place we're ready to go in and we realize billy does not have his id so we had to drive another 50 minutes back here get his id drive another 50 minutes out there and we get there and we walk in we're like all right we're finally gonna do this we were so angry with each other <laughs> and we realized they don't take card and of course i don't have any cash on me Billy really never has cash on him why on actually I, i'm lying i did have cash but it was too big of a bill so they were like yeah you're probably not going to get change and it was a 50 dollar bill and i was like uh yeah no thank you so we are at this point i'm like i'm going home i hate this like screw everything blah 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 and then on the way home billy's like there's a gas station let's just stop there and i'm like you better hope they have an i was so mad I was like you better hope they have an atm take out money and then you have to go up there and buy something because we need exact change oh my gosh it was like this whole thing so then we finally get the money we go in there they tell us oh you're in the wrong place I was like, you just spoke to us before and knew exactly what we wanted. And you told us it was $5 for each paper. <laughs> uh, uh. So then she tells us where to go. So we go there. That was fine. They really didn't know what it was for. We're getting married on a cruise. So I think like the paperwork's a little bit different from like what you normally do. So, oh my gosh, it was like the craziest thing of life. So we finally get that all settled and then we go to the post office site. I have to mail it out to somewhere in the city. So the lady at the post office was like, <laughs> like she just wasn't wording her question correctly. And like, maybe it's the teacher in me, but you think after the third time somebody is giving you the incorrect answer, you would like rephrase your question. Like, <laughs> I don't understand. <laughs> She's like, I had to like get the regular postage and then a return postage so that the people can mail me back the form. So I said to her, I need to mail this one with these in it, but I need this one to have a return postage. She's like, what's coming back? And I was like, this one. And she's like, what, but what's coming back? And I'm like, this envelope is, needs the return postage. And she's like, okay, that's not what I'm asking. So I'm like, okay, what are you asking? <laughs> She's like, which one's coming back? I'm like, <laughs> I'm like scared to say it. I'm like, this one. <laughs> like, I just wasn't understanding her question. And at this point I had been through the day already and I was like over it. And she's like, like asked, she like asked me like two or three more times. And she was like getting mad at me. I'm like, I don't understand. You're asking me which one's coming back. This is the one that's coming back. And then eventually she was like, I need to know how much postage to put on it. And I was like, oh, why didn't you just say that you needed to know? <laughs> I'm like, oh, well, only like two pieces of paper are going to go in here. And she picks up both of the envelopes, the heavy, like thick paper envelopes. And she goes, oh, so I should weigh them for like, I should give you enough postage for both of these. And I was like, <laughs> and my jaw, like once I hit the ground, I was like, well, the original one, you can give enough postage for all of this because that's what's going. I'm like, but the one that's coming back to me is not going to be that heavy. It's going to have two pieces of paper in it. 
So I was like, no, I don't think so. I don't think that weighs as much as this weighs. <laughs> and I don't know, like, granted, if the, the, that would have actually made a difference, but the whole thing was just really comical to me. And I was over it by that point. Well, I was over it by one o'clock when we had to drive back to the house and get Billy's ID. But anyway, so that was my day yesterday. Enough of that rambliness. Um, I started to read this book, Layla, by Colleen Hoover. Um, I'm reading all of Colleen Hoover's books right now just to like get them done with so I can move on to another author, but I really am enjoying her books. This book, however, guys, I'm only this much in. Okay, so I'm not even halfway. And I had to stop reading yesterday because I was petrified, okay? I was scared. Billy was sleeping. I was reading this book and I was like scared. So I had to stop reading. But it's really good and I'm excited to see like where it goes because it's a little like weird. And then like the bat, I don't know, like I'm trying to like piece it all together but I'm not even halfway through yet so I'm sure I won't be able to do that for a little while longer. But it is really good, but fair warning, it's scary. Like, it's scary. I thought it was going to be like a Verity vibes, because I Verity is like one of my top, it actually, it is my favorite book that I've ever read. Um, so I thought this was going to be like Verity vibes. It's not, I mean, like kind of, maybe a little in a certain way, but it's like really creepy. Like, it's scary. Like, I'm, I was scared reading this book yesterday. <laughs> But I'm going to return Ugly Love to my library. This book was really good. I wouldn't say really good. It was good. It was it was a good book. Um, but I still love, obviously, Verity. And obviously, It Ends With Us. Like, those books were superior. Um, and I think I'm going to like this book when I'm done with it. Because it's not, like, a typical, like, love story book. It's effed up guys it's messed up okay i'm gonna go to work and i will hopefully chat with you there i had a sub yesterday so we'll see what mess we walk into this morning coming back from a sub is always very interesting um apparently they did um they clean their desktops i guess that's what this note says all desktops done i guess that means they clean them the custodian, not the sub, by the way. Um, so it looks like they did everything. I'm not sure if they read this book. I'll have to ask my kids if they read. Oh, or throw that out. All right, I think we are all, sorry, I know you can't see me. I think we're all ready. to sign back in. I don't know my username. Uh, is it just... Okay, got it. <laughs> I normally just have to put in my password, not my username. Okay, let's see. What are we doing today? Flip my plans around. Okay, so I'm assuming they did math. So we're moving on to session five today, which is a refine day. So that's good. They can go into their groups today. Why is this not charging? So for math, we're going to do session five. Oh, I'm giving a foundation test. I have to make that copy. Okay. Foundation test, session five for math. ELA is already set up. And then writing or finishing their narrative stories. That's it. Okay. And then daily five, of course. Uh, one of my frogs is dead, so there's just a lot happening right now. So Wi-Fi is fixed. My kids were very upset when it was not working because they wanted to do daily five on the computers and they could not because the Wi-Fi was not working. Okay, let's see. Pulling out my morning slides, my math groups, and um, my math slides, and then that'll be good. I don't like coming back after stuff. I don't like it. It's very stressful. So I'm going to pull up everything. I have to print out 
my math. Yeah, because I cannot make that copy. Okay, I have to print out the math test I'm gonna give tomorrow. Not a test, it's like a quiz. And make those copies of that and the foundations test. And then I'm gonna eat my muffin. I have a chocolate muffin. They're giving us empanadas today for teacher appreciation week. They're doing something every day. So I'm excited for that. I did not bring lunch, so I'm really banking on the empanadas. So hopefully they are good or that there's any left. I have to go early to make sure. I, I'll go on my prep anyway, because I'll be in there on my prep. And I have my prep pretty early today. It's at 1040. So I think that's before all of the lunch periods anyway. So I will go in there and grab some of that. All right. I'm all set up for the day. I don't like coming back after a sub. I really don't like it. But it's all good. Okay. I'm gonna go. Eat my muffin. Make my copies. Chill out for a second. Relax. <laughs> get my mind ready for the day. And I will talk to you probably at the end of the day. Or try to get some clips throughout the day. We'll see how it goes. But I'll talk to you in a little bit. Sorry. I did not update you. It is after school now. The day was fine. Um... It actually was not bad at all. I took the kids out for like a reading outside because their music thing, prep kind of got like changed. There was a sub music teacher today and they didn't really do like, they did like academic stuff. <laughs> and I know like music is also academics, but it was, I don't know. I felt like they didn't really get like, like their time to like let loose kind of. So, I took them out. My nose is so red. I took them out for um, so that they can read outside, and they really did good with it. They enjoyed it. Even my new friend that needs, you know, some extra paying attention to, they did really good. So, very proud. And, yeah, it was a pretty good day, I will say. Not too shabby. Um, they gave us empanadas today for lunch for Teacher Appreciation Week. My kids brought in so many goodies for me, and I didn't, wasn't like expecting it at all. And they all just came in today with all these things. So it was so nice, so sweet, nice little welcome back after the crazy day that I had yesterday. And they were just so sweet all day, and we were laughing and having fun. So it was a great day. Hopefully, tomorrow can be another great day. Um, but I just picked up November 9th. I'm going to start reading this. Actually, no, I'm not. I have to start reading. I have to finish reading um, Layla. I read a little bit at work today, but I couldn't get much done because there was people everywhere. But I don't know. Layla's still creepy. Still creepy. All right, I'm going to go and I will talk to you tomorrow. Hello, everybody. It is now Friday. So happy Friday. Yay. <laughs> I'm so excited because this will be the first weekend that I am not doing Saturday school. Last week was the last week of Saturday school. So I'm so happy that I have off the rest of my Saturdays now. Um, the money was good, but waking up on Saturdays, I was over it by the end of it. Like the last couple of weeks, I was just like, okay, can we be done? Because it's just a lot after teaching for a week straight and then or for five days straight and then teaching on Saturdays it is a lot I mean my sunburn is at that point where it's like just itchy but it feels good now that you scratch it you know <laughs> um so happy Friday I'm gonna walk you through my day today I did not record yesterday because yesterday I was planning all day and I just wanted to get my plans done because there was a lot of like new things that I had to prep for. So our schedule today, my lunch is actually getting changed because the third graders, fourth grade is going on a field trip. So we had to like swap lunch periods because they're not eating lunch there, I guess. I don't know, but we're swapping lunches. So 9 10 to 9 50 we're doing our morning work eating breakfast morning meeting all that fun stuff 9 50 to 10 30 is our foundations block so we are switching classes for foundations today let me actually tell you what i'm doing mostly because i don't really know what i'm teaching for foundations today um we're doing um syllable division with 
two syllables, so we're gonna make the word limit today. I wonder if that's a word of the day, let me see. It is, it doesn't tell you it's the word of the day. Limit is the word of the day, so we're gonna make limit, and then they're gonna add that to their notebooks, and then we're going to do letter tiles. Um, okay, I just wanna like make sure I know what I'm doing. And then, dry erase dictation for the end of that. Okay, easy peasy day. Um, and then math after that from 10.30 to 11.20. Ooh, there's an ant, go away. I'm skeeved, I don't like any bugs. So math is lesson 26, session two, and we're talking about what is 10 more. They're kind of, some of them are like getting it, like one, two, three, and some of them are struggling. And then from there, we're going to lunch. Ugh, my day is gonna be all thrown off, guys. It's gonna be all thrown off. After lunch, we're gonna come back and do our spelling test like we normally do after lunch. And then they're gonna think that they're going to art. Oh, it's so frustrating. And then after that, we're gonna do a page in our math fluency book. And then we're gonna do about an hour of daily five so I can pull groups. And then um, we're gonna eat snack, 1.45 to 2.05. And then it's probably gonna be pushed back because I don't think I'm gonna, I think I overestimated. So snack's probably not gonna be that long. And then we're gonna go to art 210 to 250. And then when we come back, we do Fun Friday. And I have five friends that are not doing Fun Friday. I think I can get some of them off though, or they can get their names off if they work hard today. Um, so that is the plan for today. I'm also gonna give out our ABC countdown that's starting next week. So on Monday, I can't believe we're doing our countdown. <laughs> I can't believe it. I wanna pass these out and put these on their desks and hang one up for me so that I know what we're doing each day. Um, so on Monday, we will be artists. So I'm just gonna put on like a art hub for kids drawing video and then they can just draw um, probably something like summery or springy or something, I don't know. And I'm sure they'll love it and that kind of takes up some of my time too which is nice it gives me a little bit of a break well there's only four sessions i have one frog left he's still going semi-strong i think i don't really know <laughs> i've been trying to save my hard copies so that i have them for next year and i mean i've been doing it all year and i did it last year too but i just want to make sure i save everything so I don't have to go making something or searching for something. Also, Billy was so cute yesterday. He got me flowers delivered for Teacher Appreciation Week. I thought it was so cute. This is my binder, by the way. <laughs> of all of my important things. This is like, I have to go through and organize them by like month or like by topic or something. But it's just been going in order since I started, so I could probably figure it out. I will talk to you later. I'm on prep now. It has been a day. I'm not gonna lie to you. I feel like my makeup is down my face looking crazy, but it has been a day. Our lunch got changed today, so it was like crazy. The kids were asking me, are we leaving yet? Are we going home? I'm like, we didn't even go to art yet. We didn't even do fun Friday yet. We didn't even eat snack yet. Like, relax. So it was just a little bit of a wild day. Um, but I got a couple more appreciation gifts from my kiddos, which was so nice. And I ate some of the brownies or cupcakes that were in the faculty room. I'm looking at my leg and I have this weird, I don't know if you can see this weird tan line. It was sunburned, but now it turned to a tan. But it looks so funky because it's like just a quarter of my leg. So I just passed out some of their tests so that they can take those home. They're at art right now. I'm going to change like my calendar and everything for Monday and put up the new spelling words. And then I think everything's good to go. I'll run through my plans one more time for Monday, make sure I have everything good to go. I did homework already, made my copies already. So should be good for Monday. Um, yeah, that is it for this video. I hope that you enjoyed a couple of days in my life. I think it was what Wednesday and Friday coming back from a sub and then uh, a weird Friday 
when everything gets switched on you. This is the reality of teaching. Sometimes things are out of your control, like your lunchtime gets changed and things like that. But it's always fun, it always keeps things exciting. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna go. I hope that you enjoyed and I will see you in the next video. Bye.